A few weeks ago, I made an electrical piano, but a lot of you guys said that it might actually not be that safe. I mean, I don't know what to do with it. Like, I packed it up. I have contacted, like, every electrician in my half of Sweden. They just don't want to, they just refuse to come over. But I have one electrician from Norway who wants to come over. We just need to pay the flight. So this is the piano I have been having issues with. Like, like it's an electric piano, but whenever I play it and I play something, oh right. And then it's not supposed to do that, right? I don't think so. All right, I will turn it off. Um, right, so, okay, well, first of all, what is this? Yeah, that's, uh, that's the cable. It's like, of all the places you could go in, why would you go in here? It's like... <laughs> is that the first thing you think of? Yes, yeah, because it's like you have a cable, you need to get into the piano, and you just, like, ape brain it into the side. <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. Or should I go through the roof? Place under here, for instance. If I just pull this, it will come right out. Can the electricity go backwards? Um, well... Yeah, it can, right? Well, my point is if I pull this, then you'll have exposed wires. Yeah, so if this and that's comes loose, bad. That's very bad. Right? Yes. Like, I shouldn't have kids playing this. No, that would be... you, really, you really shouldn't. And not even, like, bad kids. Isn't it very loud in real life? Like, it's very loud. I was actually very surprised. That was, a genuine, that was a genuine reaction when I jumped to that house. <laughs> As an electrician, mm -hmm. if you would... <laughs> I. I guess you wouldn't do any of this, I realized. No. But the only thing you can really do, the golden rule of making things safe electrically, is to insulate it. Just make sure you can't touch it. Oh yeah, and that's why you didn't like my cable. Yes, well exposed. as part of it. No, I do, I see some burn marks on the... Um... Yes, that one burned. Yeah. The electricity cost in Sweden is very high right now. Mm -hmm. Do you think this piano is the reason? The reason why all of Sweden is paying so much for <laughs> yeah. electricity, definitely. It didn't register that much. It looks like a lot, but it doesn't necessarily mean it draws a lot of uh, power. Connect one side to ground and touch the hammers with it. or To the ground? Like ground? Like, <laughs> <laughs> like this, this ground, the thing that you've cut oh. there. Oh, it's not... Do you like pianos? They're okay. Yeah. Do you like this piano? No. It's just a bad idea. What makes you think that? The fact that it's deadly. <laughs> it's very... It's not good. Oh, would you save me if... Well, if I... If you were... You uh, should hit me with a stick. But, or I could take off my, uh, my hoodie and put it around you and then pull. Oh, is that an electrician? Yes. An trick? Electrician trick. Are you ready? Damn yeah. it, I don't hear anything. Yes, I'm ready. And now I don't see anything. <laughs> <laughs> What's your initial thoughts about this? I can't see it. Yeah, can you watch so no hammer welds? Because I can't see it. What? <laughs> <laughs> I can't hear anything. How is this connected? Oh, the... don't touch it. I'm not touching it. I just spun it a couple times. I, mean, I was so surprised that I connected the entire frame with that little cable. <laughs> like if I did that, my boss would shoot me, I'm fairly sure. Norwegian Air was kind of expensive, but this video is sponsored by Established Titles. Did you know that if you own any piece of land in Scotland, Scottish Customs officially title you Lord or Lady, even if it's like this small, and they send you this high quality certificate, and even gives you a plot number so you can see exactly where your land is. But the best part is that all of this is for a good cause. So we can get electricians to check. But it's also for charity. They work with a bunch of different charities like One Tree Planted and Trees for the Future to plant a tree with every order. The first 200 people purchasing a title pack using my link will be placed within walking distance to my plot so we can create an engineering kingdom. With this, you can put Lord or Lady in front of your name. You can have it on your credit card, on your plane ticket, or on your dating profile. I'm not sure if that would help though. Established Titles is already running a massive sale right now, but if you use code Matthias, you will get an additional 10% off. So go to establishedtitles.com slash Matthias and buy your gifts today. 
Maybe it, maybe it's fine after all. <laughs> it's fine. Yeah, I think it's just just leave it like this. I think it's good. Just that's my professional uh, <laughs> advice. It's fine. Yeah, it's fine. I see some of your strings are broken. <laughs> when I edited, I just heard explosions. <laughs> what do you work? What do you do as an electrician? Not this. <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, generally just house electrics, like I would, for instance... Oh, wait. Like, what, is, what is that? <laughs> <laughs> it's my dad who made it. Uh, I hope so. Yeah, so when you turn off the lights in this room... Oh, damn, I touched the piano. <laughs> <laughs> when you turn off the lights, you also turn off all the contacts. Sh they should be possible to just rewire it, it looks like. What do you have to do to make the... like? You just want me to do electrical work in your house. <laughs> <laughs> I can yeah. do it if you want. <laughs> I think in theory, to make that properly safe, you'd need to like be able to lock it. Because anyone can open it and touch the hammers, even if you do close it. Probably discharge the piano. Yes. <laughs> oh. No, you don't work a lot with components, right? No, not really. Yeah. Electrician is actually like the most unrelated profession I could take here. Yes. <laughs> well, I mean, you could get a bartender, which would be <laughs> worse. Take a shot every time it sparks. I've never seen someone discharge a piano before. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to see the other project? Yes. You see? Yeah. I wonder if I can put electrical tape over it. I don't think so. You don't? <laughs> no. I like I work with voltages up to a thousand. That's what I'm allowed to work with, basically. See what happens. Better, I mean. Like it's. Everything I've seen here since I got here has been <laughs> sus. Oof. Like this? It shouldn't. Never mind. <laughs> that was obvious. Well, just imagine some musical tone and that's basically the project. Okay, I can think of easier ways to get um, musical notes. How? By like playing a piano. <laughs> yeah. Burning. Yeah, it's just, the capacitors are kind of hot. You like hot in a cute way? True. I do have an electric piano at home, actually. Oh, like this? Uh, no. On the video it's funny, but in real life... There's a deep feeling of dread. <laughs> yeah, it is. Five mega ohms. You have... Uh, <laughs> have I a lot of resistance? It looks well, like... Yeah, wait, let me try me. Oh, so I'm made to make... You're made for this. <laughs> what do you have? 0 0.7. <laughs> Why do you have such dry hands? <laughs> Isn't that... Uh, You're going to connect it in that? No. What's that? <laughs> what? Arrows. <laughs> Electrician arrow. Yeah. I'm going to make a bow. It's a good, safe, permanent connection. Thing very unsettling with connecting stuff into that thing. <laughs> Do you think it will explode? Yes. Oh, okay, let's turn it on. I don't think anything will happen. <laughs> <laughs> that, that did not sound convincing. I don't think touching this is ever going to produce enough current to actually trigger an earth leakage. Should we turn it on? Yeah, we should. Ah. <laughs> yeah, see, nothing happened. Oh, do you want to have that on? Okay. No, when I get close to it, the red light... What? How? Why? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you want to be that close to that frame? Wait, is this all? Wait, no. It's kind of grounded. I think you should just throw away the piano, to be honest. <laughs> you haven't turned it on, oh. Right? Uh, no. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> I touched the key. Yeah, but I found that grease in many stuff I buy, from China especially. But it's usually a lot more of that white stuff. It's China grease? The engineers are... <laughs> Offloading. Send this shit to Europe. <laughs> if I put resistors somewhere, they will drain, slowly drain the capacitors. Yes, they will. Not my no, no. field. Yeah, no, None I of didn't. this is my field. <laughs> I don't know why <laughs> no. I'm here. So basically what we have realized today is that we just need to put this panel on. <laughs> That's really now, good. Now I'm fine with it. You maybe didn't have to fly from Norway. I like the, the piano well, shit. <laughs> oh, it's, it's still quite here. loud. It's, it's loud. still really loud. It feels a lot better now. Definitely. I'm starting to realize that electrician isn't what we should have gotten here. 
but I actually have an electrical engineer who wants to come over and check on the piano. Only issue is he specializes on wind turbines, but I'm thinking that there might be some similarities. So you're like an electrical engineer? I am an electrical and automation engineer. Open, make sure to not touch anything in this piano. It's kind of electric. Oh yeah. Oh. Have you uh, seen the video I sent, by the way? You don't? No, I never got it because I checked my email, but it just didn't come. So yeah, then this might uh, come as a surprise. Basically, we want to make this electric piano more safe. Yeah. Because right now, whoa, it's like, yeah, yeah, it's. Uh, so, uh, hmm. is this what you expected to see? No, not really. Definitely not. Oh, that's crazy. Oh. Mm -hmm. I see. Okay, you you expect like a regular electric? Yeah, I don't. I didn't know exactly. No. Because, <laughs> oh. But what I would say right now is there's definitely a live wire connected to those strings. Yeah, and that should, <laughs> if you want to avoid wait. that, you should take okay. that away. Uh, do you regret coming over now when you saw? Oh, no, absolutely, that doesn't scare me because as a technician, it would like I'm curious to see. Oh, what this I can doesn't fix. scare you? Absolutely not. I can definitely say that this is something that can be remedied quite quickly. But And uh, furthermore, I do see like electrical equipment on this piano, but I'm quite unsure if it's supposed to be electric b based on the model and the age of this. It's really supposed to be. It's a, it's a modification I've done because I thought it looks kind of cool. Well, it is yeah. absolutely gobsmacking. Like the moment you did that, I mean, sure, I wasn't scared, but I my mind did said, uh, say, what the F? <laughs> Definitely. Do you, wait, do you think uh, you should wear like welding gear or something when you play it? Like what? Absolutely. You should definitely have safety goggles on. Oh, yeah. Uh, gloves? yeah, these kinds oh, of gloves. Oh, you work on live wire? Can Sometimes when you're troubleshooting. And also mm -hmm. uh, we have like switch gear and basically that's a what transformer. That? How far away do you think this piano is from getting like CE marked? Like European, like oh, huh. as for a kid to play it? Well, I'd say that <laughs> that right now is not even a dream. Okay. And no one should play this in their right mind. And the resistor, mm -hmm. and that thing, blown. yeah, it turns into like a lamp. Yeah, I get it. Mm -hmm. Because yeah. of the short circuit. Do you have any like wind turbine trick for, for things to not get stuck from the start? Well, I would say that you might need to cover them, the strings per se, the metal strings, with a little bit of plastic at least so that uh, the surface area of contact would be very small you should understand that this is totally thinking outside the box because uh, this yeah, is yeah, quite yeah. unusual yeah yeah this uh, this is not what you sign up for <laughs> well yeah well <laughs> it is risky for sure but yeah. with this plexiglass and the gloves and the glasses of course i would deem it safe and then if anything happens then we can just pull out the plug yeah oh you deem it safe that's that's nice when I turn off this piano, mm -hmm. uh, it, it's still charged. Like, it's not even in now. Yeah. You see it's still. Yeah, but that's because of the capacitor. Sure. In electrical terms, it's called a dynamic resistor. Mm -hmm. Basically something that consumes the power so yeah. that the capacitors will lose charge much quicker than they would do right now. So uh, I would say that could be a good thing. Okay, now it's on. Wow. Oh. Wow. This makes a really shitty piano player look good. <laughs> yeah, it would be interesting to see when a pro uh, plays it. Yeah, plays that would it. be crazy. If a stand falls into the piano and I like touch it, <laughs> oh, they look nice. On you. Yeah, then you would be fine. <laughs> Do you see anything? Yeah. Like it's an experiment. Like this is totally <laughs> new to me. I've never seen anything like this. I think and the it's... first time you struck the keys, I, I think like something happened to my brain. <laughs> like, I, yeah. I'm surprised you. I thought you were going to storm out because you were like, <laughs> <laughs> oh, the electro boom is. Do you watch like electric videos on YouTube? No, you don't, right? I have seen a little bit. Uh, there was this guy on YouTube that basically gets shocked all the time. Oh, he has helped with his piano. And oh, he, right. gave me, he gave me He gave idea. you the tips? Yeah, yeah. Wow. Like disposable yeah, camera. That's how you got the capacitors. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Imagine something like this at a, at a live performance, like let's say... Uh, yeah, that's what we're trying to... Like when right. I go take... Wait, do you think like customs will stop me when I take this to Germany? They wouldn't have the slightest clue what it is. Yeah. Because, I mean, it's not like some kind of explosive device or... Well, nah, it, 
a it's conventional electrician. Like, no, no, no. This is not a device you're constructing and thinking about safety. Because <laughs> if it was only safety related, this would never happen. Like, yeah. this is purposefully unsafe. These capacitors may explode or, you know, something like that. But if you have the lid on and the plexiglass, then you should be fine. And plus you have goggles. Wait, you don't, do you do house electricity? Well, I have a little bit. I have dabbled a little bit. Uh, like, are you allowed to do it? Well, uh, under <laughs> supervision. When you applied to the job, mm -hmm. uh, I said like electric piano that sparks. Yeah. Yeah. And then when we had a call, you asked if you should take your multimeter. Yeah, to like, measure. Like I thought what? that you wanted to fix like what did you like what was... my my initial perspective actually was that yeah you wanted to make it safe but like like a regular like digital electric piano right that was my thought i didn't uh, yeah. think about this at all <laughs> this is uh, on well, another that, level i'm actually perfect. wowed by this i am right now going to answer a thousand comments on this video so let me know your worst piano ideas that would be fun also if you haven't seen how i made this piano click here